question 15 the diagram shows three points P Q and R are on the level ground the bearing of Q from P is 100 degrees the bearing of R from Q is 150 degrees and P Q equals Q R find angle Q P R angle Q P R so it's this angle that we are looking for then B is the bearing of P from R P from R so meaning we stand at R and draw this line here so it's this line that we are looking for that angle okay so we we'll start with A so what are the things that we know about A so the thing that we know about A is that by the virtue of the fact that two sides are equal it means this angle and this angle are the same so let us call this angle x and this angle should be x so for us to find the value of x we need to know this angle so from the information that we've been given you can find that angle once we know this angle which i can call this angle to be z so this means z means x plus x plus let us call z is equal to 180 degrees so meaning 2x is equal to 180 degrees minus z so this is the thing that we need to do so once we do that we can simplify that so it means x is equal to 180 minus z degrees over 2 so this is the principle that we are going to have so we need to find z so to find z let me go to a bigger space so to find z we use the corresponding angles from the parallel lines so if you have two parallel lines these lines are parallel remember north north are parallel then we cut like this this angle and this angle is equal then this angle and this angle are equal that's what it means so based on that principle we can just extend this line a bit because the north is a straight line and this line a north straight line so what this tells me is if this angle is 100 degrees then this angle which is similar to y y this angle should also be 100 degrees based on that principle then because the north is a straight line this is a straight line the north what it means is I can call this angle to be anything I call it M so it means M plus 150 degrees is equal to 180 because it's a straight line then I can find what M is so M is equal to 180 minus 150 M is equal to 30 degrees so since M is equal to 30 degrees I know the entire angle now I know what Z is. Z is equal to 100 degrees plus 30 degrees which is equal to 130 degrees. So having found this I can go back and find now what is X. So X is equal to 180 degrees minus 130 degrees which we found here over 2 so dividing these two we are going to end up with 15 subtracting these two 15 divided by 2 which will give me 25 degrees so 25 degrees is in angle QPR so you come here in an exam you write this one nicely then you get these two marks so we are done with A we go to B, the bearing of P from R. Now remember we know what X is. This is X is equal to 25 degrees. So it's no longer X. So this is 25. So we are coming here, then doing finding this angle. That's what we are doing. So let me go to a bigger space. Remember, we are finding the bearing of P from R. So if it's P from R, you stand at R always. A from B, you stand at B, then do the clockwise direction to find the bearing. That's what you do. 
so I'm going to use this bigger space so we draw a line here then we find this angle that's what you're looking for but we found x this is 25 degrees this is 25 degrees then we know this is 130 degrees so we know from here to here this is 180 because it's a straight line this is a north then we know we can find this angle from blue so this angle using again the corresponding lines like we did this angle should be equal to this or angle up to here okay should be the same now this angle is 100 plus 25 degrees so this angle will be 125 degrees so now since we know the angle we can find the bearing so now the bearing is just a summation of these two angles to be 180 degrees plus 125 degrees then we start adding so we get 100 plus 180 is 280 then 25 plus 80 is 105 so we are getting 305 so the easiest way to add 180 125 0 plus 5 is a 5 2 plus 8 is a 10 card 1 then 1 plus 1 is a 3 so we have 305 degrees so 305 degrees is the answer here that's the bearing of p from r once you do this you are good to go you get these four marks if you haven't downloaded the app you are missing a lot go to the google play store or check on our link in the description section all the best